Aloha. Happy Sunday, everyone. It's Aniela here. <laughs> How are you, folks? I hope you're all doing well. Happy Sunday. Um, my name is Aniela, and I am a coach with the Be With Your Twin Flame program. I hope you all are doing well. Um, today, we're going to be talking about a question. Oh, gosh, it's one of those things. If I had a dollar for every time this question came up, um, you know, it's one of those things that is an absolute hallmark on this journey. It happens so much and so often that this question comes up. And um, it came up for me as well several times on my journey, especially starting out. And um, we want to talk about it today because there's actually a reason and an answer to this question that, you know, so many times there's just, it, there doesn't seem to be answers for much, um, the, at least not the answers you're looking for, but I do have an answer for you on this and it actually helps a lot. When I myself on this journey was able to figure this part out, um, if you are on a twin flame journey, uh, you are probably finding yourself in some of the most uh, difficult, what feels like the most difficult time in your life there's so much confusion and there's so much um, there can be so much sadness grief anguish and all of those things that came out of something that was so seemingly in in the the most beautiful part of it the most beautiful thing that ever happened to you in your life and um, it's very common that people will come across this as I have um, if you are finding you are on a twin flame journey and it is one of those things that you're just not sure. It's very, it can be very confusing. Um, but when we're talking about the twin flame journey, folks, um, you're out here, you're looking for information that's going to help you feel better. You're looking to find out like what exactly is going on with me? Uh, what exactly is happening? And if you're here, there's no mistake you're here. This is your soul leading you here to see this message and probably a number of other messages um, from Elle's channel and Elle's page. Elle Hari is the creator of the Magnetize Your Twin Flame program. She is my teacher and coach and just the most amazing person with the most amazing focus to be able to use what she learned to help us all. When I found myself um, on this journey, there were no answers. There were absolutely no answers that made any sense that was helping me to get anywhere to feeling better. So we are here to help dispel so much of the BS that's out there and to get you knowing and understanding and just not just understanding, but resonating with the type of journey you're really on. This journey, folks, is not about the twin flame. You know we've talked about that so many times, and it is true. This journey is about you. So you'll find yourself on this journey, and you will go through things. You will go through emotions, especially. You will go through thoughts, obsessing, all of these things. You will go through it, and you are coming along to a place that you're feeling better. You're feeling better. You're moving along. You're thinking to yourself, oh, I got this. I'm doing this. I can do this. I'm getting better. I'm feeling better. And then all of a sudden, you're going to feel like you're going backwards. You're going backwards. You start doing things that you start letting these thoughts come up that, um, that you know is not helping you, but it's just so darn difficult to get out of. You're doing that it's and it pulls you right back in. You get sucked right back in to the cyclone and it just twirls you around, throws you around, throws you back on the floor. And you get you, you get up again and a little bit of time passes again. And you start to feel better again. You start to feel a little bit better again. You start to feel like, "Oh my gosh, okay, I think I'm I'm finally getting there." And a little bit of time will go by or a trigger will come up, a certain date will come up and all of a sudden, bam, you're back in it again. Those things happen so often on this journey that don't, they don't typically happen 
in regular 3D, quote unquote, relationships, remember folks, this is not a relationship. This is a reunion of your soul. The twin flame journey is a reunion of your soul, but it presents itself as a type of relationship, a very highly charged chemist, chemistry driven, sexually driven sometimes, um, very heavily relationship. And when you're going through this kind of thing in the 3D and regular physical relating with a soulmate, it doesn't, it doesn't really do that. Sometimes you'll feel better, then you'll feel like crap again. But on the twin flame journey, it is an absolute hallmark to go through this several times that you're feeling like you're going backwards. You're literally, literally going backwards and you're not. Let me tell you right now, you're not. And one of the things that I had to reconcile and deal with is understanding why I felt like I was going backwards. When you are on this journey, folks, it's all about you. So everything, and I have said this before, I'll say it, say it again. No one is prepared for this journey. No one is. No one but your soul knows you are ready, but there's no way we can really prepare for it. So you get thrown into the mix, you start doing things and you start applying things that you know that helped you before, helped you cope with loss, cope with breakups, things like that. And it'll, it'll feel better <laughs> for a little while, it will, and you're right back in the throes of it. You're right back feeling like you're going backwards. And what's happening is actually when you are starting to learn how to balance your fear-based energy, and we'll talk about that in a little bit you are actually going to be starting to learn how to unlearn. You're actually unlearning things that you knew all going through your life on how to cope with things, how to cope with situations that are similar to this or feel like they're similar to this. You are unlearning things and that's why it feels like you're going backwards. When you are trying to move forward and balance the energy, Balance the fear-based energy, which you need to do if you ever want to feel better, if you ever want to be in a permanent and lasting relate, relating experience with your twin flame, you have to balance your fear-based energy. But in the process of doing that, there will be several times you feel like you're going backwards. And that's what it is. It's all part of unlearning the things that aren't working for you anymore that aren't going to help you, especially on this journey. So that process of unlearning can help people to feel like, oh my God, I feel like I took four steps forward and three steps back. And that's what it kind of feels like, or vice versa. You know, you feel like, oh my gosh, but it's actually a process of unlearning. Um, we, I'm going to mention something because out in this, um, out there in, in, the internet land, there are people who really um, look towards astrology. Now, folks, I'm going to tell you right now, astrology and the twin flame journey and what this journey is really all about, they do not go hand in hand. But there is something in astrology that we happen to be in the middle of two of them right now that kind of illustrates what's happening. Um, yesterday, I took a very long road trip and, um, you know, on the highway, and what, what happens is when you're traveling at a high speed on the highway, um, you're, you're moving forward if there's more than one lane. Of course, the two cars in the, in, the, in the same direction is moving forward. If one car starts to go faster than the other car, the other car, if you're in the quicker, the faster car, will look like it's going backwards. And that is, a, is an illustration of the retrograde planets. Right now we're in the middle of Mercury and Mars metro retrograde, which is coming to an end. And although astrology folks, again, I will tell you this loud and clear, do not apply astrology on your twin flame journey. You are only sabotaging yourself. You are, nobody wants to hear that, but it's the truth. And we don't, we don't bullshit you <laughs> on our videos and in this program. We don't bullshit you. There's enough of that out there. And people love to eat that up, soak that up because it makes them feel good. It makes them feel like they're in control. But you apply astrology to your twin flame journey, you are literally taking the gun and shooting this yourself in your own foot. So you want to stop that right now. But the illustration of Mars and Mercury retrograde in the planets, 
we're moving forward. The planets are moving forward, just like the, the two cars I'm, I'm describing to you from my road trip yesterday. When one car shoots past the other car, the other car is still moving forward. But in this quicker car, it'll look like it's going backwards, and it's not. Folks, you are never going backwards on this journey. It will feel like you are. It will certainly feel like you are. But you are always, always moving forward. The process of unlearning things and teaching yourself and taking what we teach you here in this program on how to balance your fear-based energy, it is a process of unlearning what you, what you think you already know what you've read out there that you've applied and it's just really causing more of a crap load of trouble for you because it doesn't work. If you're doing all of that and thinking all of that and trying all of that, you're going to have to unlearn that to be able to balance your fear-based energy. And that's why so many times it feels like you're going backwards. Even if you find yourself doing this or having this happen prior to even enrolling in our program, it's because there is a process and you are still, still trying to unlearn things whether you consciously know it or not. Okay, so that's what we want to dispel for you. There is no going backwards on this journey. And if you're ready to take that step to know in yourself right here, right now, I'm moving forward. I'm going to be looking at this because I am ready to feel better, Aniela. Folks, we have uh, just all types of options for you. For people who, who are really, really committed to themselves and really want to learn how to feel better, how to balance their fear-based energy, and eventually, yes, eventually, if that's something you want, to be able to have a normal, normal, whatever normal is, or shall I say a peaceful, relating experience and relationship with the TF, you're going to have to learn how to balance your energy. We have options available for you. We have financing options with no credit check. We have all these things available for you to help you get started on your journey. You're going to want to click on the link below to do that. Alrighty, so if you've been resonating with what I've been talking about today, just know this, you're not going backwards. You are never going backwards on this journey. You are always, always moving forward. Alrighty, folks, aloha from the beautiful land across the ocean in Hawaii. I wish all of you a happy Sunday. God bless, and we'll talk to you again soon. Bye, everybody.